Hello and welcome to the Habit Coach podcast. I am Ashton Doctor, your Habit Coach, and today in the hot seat we have Padma Shini. Padma Shini says, "How to develop the habit of acceptance? Like in life, it is really necessary, and everyone fights to accept the fact. So, what is your idea of acceptance?" Padma Shini, I love this because there are two words that keep getting thrown around: acceptance and surrender. Right now, let's understand these two because they are often misunderstood. So you surrender to the big things in life. You surrender to the things that you can't change. You surrender to the stuff that is outside your control. Okay. Now that is the key thing. You always surrender to things that are outside your control. So that means you do everything in your control to a point, and things beyond that you surrender to. Now the problem is when people think about acceptance. they think about acceptance of the things that are coming to them we think about acceptance in the future tense right i am going to accept everything that is coming to me all right now this is where we make our mistake because what we have to do is we have to surrender to what is coming to us but we have to accept only the things that have happened in the past if we accept the stuff that is coming in the future that means you are not going to do anything you're not going to make any changes you're not going to take any action in your life because you just it's i'm just accepting everything that's coming to me instead you have to accept the stuff that has happened surrender to all the stuff that is outside your control that is happening in your future but take action on everything that is about to take place if you're living in the moment you're constantly taking action on the stuff that is happening or is going to happen to you in the future so you're preparing for it It is like saying I will accept the fact that I'll be staying on the road. No. If you take your right steps to do things, you might not end up staying on the road. You might have a beautiful villa somewhere. So the idea is to understand that acceptance is beautiful when it's about the past. Many of us don't accept the past. We live in denial of the past. No, no, no. It could not have happened. I could not have been that stupid. Are you were that stupid. That is why you're in this situation. That is the key. we often think about the past and we don't accept it we are in denial there is no way this person cheated me they cheated you that is why you are in this situation so all you have to do is understand that the past is not something that you can change you can only change the present and hence by that effect the future so what you have to do is understand and accept the past completely in the present you make every single possible action thought manifestation that you can think of and whatever is coming to you in the future you surrender to it knowing well that you've prepared and you've done your part in creating that awesome life that awesome future for yourself if we get this mixed up if we get into this whole acceptance of the future we are screwed it is like saying that we have no free will whatever is going to come to us is coming to us and then what is the point of living that way you're constantly going to be blaming god you're going to be blaming the universe for things that were actually and possibly in your control so you still have to do the work like i always tell people you know even if it is something like winning a lottery ticket you still have to go and buy the lottery ticket no you still have to do that first step so even then even if there is providence or some luck that is coming your way if you don't take that first action that luck is never going to reach you So always think about it this way accept the past surrender to the future take complete action now in the present all right i hope that answered your question this is my view on acceptance if you have a question for me ask me in the next hot seat episode and i'm going to answer your question there's a link below check it out i'm ashton doctor your habit coach